In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to lock your iPhone to one specific app. So this can be useful, especially if you want to give your phone to a child or to someone who likes opening other apps on your iPhone and you want to restrict them to only one application. Okay, so I'll be showing you how to do that. So what you want to do is use guided access. Okay, now before you can use guided access, you have to first of all enable it. So go to settings. Under settings, go to accessibility. And then under accessibility, scroll down and tap on guided access. So tap on that and then you want to enable guided access. Now, once you enable guided access, there are a couple of other things uh, you can get. For instance, you have passcode settings. OK, so do you want guided access to use Face ID? If not, then you can disable that. If you want it to use uh, Face ID, you can enable that. You also can set a guided access passcode from here. Of course, if it's the first time as you're setting up guided access, it may ask for a passcode, but you can actually set a passcode from here. So let me set the guided access passcode to one, two, three, four, five, six. Obviously you want a better passcode like that. And then now you can exit out of here and then you have time limits. So you have a specific time limit for which you've set for that particular guided access session to be used. Okay. So after the time elapses, do you want your phone to make a sound? You can choose that sound or you want it to speak okay and then you have the accessibility shortcut which basically allows you to triple press on the side button to access the guided access settings so you can start guided access and even end guided access by triple pressing the side button then the next thing is display auto lock so this sets how long it takes your your iPhone to automatically lock during a guided access uh, session. So you can just leave that as default. So now that you've set everything up, now just go ahead and open the app. So let's say you want to, uh, you want to lock which app? Let's say the Amazon app, okay? So I'm just gonna launch that app. Or oh, the most commonly locked app is YouTube. So let's go to YouTube. Maybe you're giving your phone to a child and that child or that person is watching something and you don't want to leave, you don't want them to leave the YouTube app. So launch YouTube and then triple press on the side button. And from the menu that appears, tap on guided access. And that's going to start guided access in a, one second. So you can see guided access has been started. Now guided access has some settings. Some will even disable the touch screen. Okay. So that if you're playing something, Let's say, let's first of all e exit so I can play a video. There's the passcode. So I'm going to end it for now. Okay. And then I'm going to play a video. Let's play one from our channel like that. Okay. So you have that video playing on YouTube. So Enable guided access by triple pressing the button and then selecting guided access. And it says guided access has been started. And as you can see, guided access actually has been started. And so my particular option disables even the touch screen. So this is especially useful for a child. If a child is watching something on your phone, they can't even touch the screen, they can't do they can't go next, they cannot increase volume, they cannot leave the app. It's basically locked, although the video is playing on YouTube. So you can go and triple press the guided access option again, and then tap on guided access. And that's going to ask for a passcode. So enter the passcode. And then you have the option to resume guided access. If you want to continue with guided access, you can stop or end guided access from here, or you can change the options. So if you go to options, you can choose what you allow and what you don't allow inside guided access. So do you want to lock the side button? Do you want to lock or enable the volume buttons? 
okay so by default the volume buttons have been disabled so during the guided access the user cannot increase or reduce the volume and then you have the motion for the display you have touch okay so as you can see this is off and that's why the touch screen was not working now you can enable touch screen and allow that person to navigate the app within guided access they still cannot leave the app but they can navigate and they can watch whatever they want so it's basically very customizable right so let's go back to the options once again the password every time you want to exit guided access you have to enter the guided access password or passcode that's not your iphone's passcode that's a spe special passcode for guided access so basically that's how to use guided access and how to lock your iphone 16 to one app okay so let's go let's go ahead and exit so you tap on end and once you end guided access you know back into your iphone and you can use any app so that is basically how to lock your iphone 16 or iphone 16 pro to one specific app now this can be used on older iphones as well but these instructions were made on the iphone 16 pro max thank you for watching if you have any comments or questions feel free to leave them down below in the comment section and also if you found this useful don't forget to leave a like and maybe even subscribe for more tips and i'll talk to you guys in the next one good luck